Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your August 2018 general reading. Now this is a general reading, so it will resonate with a few, not all. Um, I hope that it resonates with all. If it doesn't, uh, check your rising moon, Venus uh, sign. Um, if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. Um, okay, yeah, quick issue negative comments in the comment section let's all do our job to keep this a peaceful channel uh, a peaceful outlet where we can come and get answers in the midst of negativity and turbulence in our own lives we don't want to come to the channel and have negativity so if you see a negative comment down in the comment section just quietly and quickly click that report button and report it as spam or report it as whatever but we want to police this channel it's not just my channel it's everyone's channel we come here for positivity if you're not here for that you will you will be reported how about that anyhow let's get into it okay so we got our shells here aquarius Lots of um, overwhelming energy. Someone's it just feels completely overwhelmed. Uh, you could be moving. You could be sh shifting jobs, going into a new business, starting a new business, starting a new job, uh, putting out resumes, putting out, putting yourself out there. Some of, some of you have some health issues. It looks like you're you're trying to get on top of that in regards to. Uh, starting new regimens of, uh, surrounding your health. You're also consulting with physicians. I'm hearing blood work, so something to do with insurance. Uh, hmm. Somebody's keeping a big secret, or they want to keep you a secret, or you're keeping a big secret. You're scared for it to get out. It's going to come out. It's going to come out because this is your tower moment. This is the universe coming to help you get to a place of you being true to you. Some of you, it has something to do with your sexuality. Okay. You have a family though. like um, nu Nuclear family. Uh, husband, wife, children. Um, and then... You know, there's a question of, you know, sexuality here. So, that's that. Some of you, there's someone that makes you super emotionally confused. It's almost like water energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, but whatever. Um, they make you very confused in regards to dealing with them. You know that there is love that rests in between you two, but at the same time, there is an obstacle. I don't know if it's another person, a situation, an issue, a child. I don't know. Uh, but there is an obstacle in in the midst of you two coming together. There's also ego. Okay, ego. Seeing ego. A lot of ego. <sighs> Whether it's you or the other person. You have to break down the wall, the barrier, the ego, or it's not going to work. Okay. Just heard that. Money's tight for some of you. Money's good for a lot of you. Um, Money is like, it's up and down, but then it, it stabilizes and it's up and down. And, you know, it's, it's, um, it's almost like that eight of pentacles energy like you're doing the work you're seeing the money but then it goes and then you know whatever okay I don't know something about a Libra or an air sign a Gemini Libra Aquarius hmm 
like yourself something with an air sign i don't know i'm not seeing what it is with them, but it's like something there okay let's get into the cart it's like too much time in the shelves Okay, let's jump into love. All right. Thank you, Heavenly Father, for true, accurate messages for Aquarius. The Aquarius Collective in regards to love. What are the messages for love for Aquarius? Thank you for accuracy, answers, truth, and clarity. Okay, all right. Bottom of the deck, the seven of cups. What did I tell you? Something about confusion, maybe with a water sign, maybe illusions, maybe uh, dreams, imagination. It's something here that puts you in a, a fog dealing with maybe a water sign. Okay, career and finance messages for Aquarius. Career and finance messages. I'm not going to take those, but we'll take that one. Career and finance messages for Aquarius. Just saw the Knight of Wands. There could be some fast movement into another, um, into another uh, job sector or another job or another career field. And it's quick. It's something you need to act fast on. And when I tell you the death card, endings and new beginnings complete transformation in regards to career and finance all right now we have butterfly oracle cards let's see thank you for the messages the additional supportive messages take the next step now just go ahead and dump that one that i don't really want to come out take the next step now nice and then this one we'll leave that one face down bottom of the deck wow self-employment nice Aquarius all right get some good stuff self-employment so if you've been thinking about it the cards are telling you you're on the right path here uh, it's highlighted for a reason self-employment all right angel answers cards so if you have a question out there um, send your attentions this way and here are the answers to that question angel answers thank you for answers to Aquarius questions oh white wow okay okay bottom of the deck oh what okay yes Aquarius, whatever you're thinking about, it's a yes answer. Beautiful. All right, let's go. Okay, love. We have the ooh, Ace of Pentacles, the Hermit, the Eight of Wands, the Lovers. Nice. Something in regard to, I'm seeing when these two are here, this is Cancer. Uh, of course, we have Virgo and we have Gemini here. And then we have a little fire, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. But things start moving fast for you. We've got the Ace of Pentacles. We've got someone going inward in regards to maybe they're trying to make a choice. Who do, who do they give this pentacle to? Now, this could be you, Aquarius, or this could be someone you're dealing with. It seems as if, th if there's been an energetic shift in regards to you dealing with someone who needs to make a decision in regards to... Um, Okay, I'm here. Sexuality again. We've got the two naked people here. Sexuality in regards to uh, making a choice of uh, who they want to be with. I'm here. Family, family, or this other person. But there's a lot of rapid communication. I think this person is waiting for you, Aquarius. They're waiting for you to get solid on what you want. And what your choice for some of you is the Aquarius choice for some of you it's the other party there's confusion here because there are options it is also for some of you it's almost illusionary it's, it's imaginary it's like well 
could this really be happening for me some of you this could even this could be engagement moving in together solidifying the relationship this is love i'm going to kind of tie it to self-employment too this could be the start of a new business we saw that in the in the shells or i saw in the shells anyway um the arrows of love communication this could even be communication about the trouble in an existing relationship whether it's in your existing relationship Aquarius or the existing relationship of your partner but it looks like there's rapid movement toward someone making a final decision or decision in regards to who they want to be with they feel like this is a soulmate they've been enlightened to the fact that there is something here something more than just illusion and 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 sex and sex sexual um encounters that's what i'm hearing all right let's jump this this it looks good for love aquarius it looks like somebody's the the energy is shifting it's moving in the direction of someone making a real solid choice they're making a solid some of some of the people you're dealing with uh, they may already be partnered. They may already be married. They may already be in a long-standing relationship. They're uh, contemplating moving away from that. They're trying to make a choice. That could be for you, Aquarius, or the other person. Seven of Cups. They're confused. Could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer highlighted. Virgo, Gemini. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, everybody's here, okay? Um, all right, career and finance, the death card, the bottom of the deck, king of cups, the chariot. What did I tell you is a cancer here? Seven of wands, the sun. I think you finally, in your career and finance sector, you finally get a, get to a place where you can choose to put your energy, your time, your effort, your love, your um, work into something that fulfills you on an emotional level. It, it fills you. You also do have the creative. I don't know, spirit wise, um, you got the King of Cups here. They're governed by the moon. Something with spirit. You might be doing some spiritual work. You could be a light worker tarot card reader psychic anyway you're moving forward with this and you're having victory you're getting in control of how you want this business uh to go you're actually taking it as a business something that you do creatively uh it could be painting it could be making things with your hands i don't know it's something that that completely you could do for free if you know you could live life for free you would do it for free but of course we all need money um, it's something that you're it's close and dear to your heart it's something that influence you or your influences outside of yourself is spiritual in nature also seven of wands you get very solid on the on the fact that this is what you want to do you're narrow narrowing down your options or just get get into a place where this is your focus and it's bringing you some real positive energy, complete transformation in, in how you do your work or what you do for work and how you make money and how you sustain yourself. Uh, I think some of you are going into business for yourself. Some of you are changing jobs. Get into an environment where there is more um, opportunity to be creative, to be unique. intuition is heightened here you might even have help from a fire sign Aries, Sagittarius Leo okay all right under the deck for the butterfly oracle we had self-employment is highlighted it looks like you you ending something and going into something uh, new for you take the next step now that's what the cards say whatever that may mean to you take the next step now uh, don't procrastinate changing your mind it looks like you have change your mind in regards to maybe love uh career and finance 
I mean, it could be almost anything, but this reading is so positive. Aquarius hadn't had a positive reading like this in a while. I mean, positive in regards to career and finance, love. All right, angel answers. Okay, so if you got a question out there, the answer is yes. And this could be in regards to love, career, finance, family, whatever. The answer is yes. Okay. Then we have improving health, and we saw that in the shells. Some of you are concerned about health and you're definitely some yeah, changing um your exercise routine or, or instituting one. You may not have had one. Uh, within the next few months. So yes, within the next few months, improving your health. Nice. Within the next few months, so it could be money, it could be love, it could be solidifying a relationship, it could be anything. But within the next few months, there will be change. We have the death card here. And this doesn't just come in overnight. This takes time. So uh, transformation, complete transformation, a new life. And it looks like that's what's happening for you, Aquarius. Some of you could be moving to, yeah, some of you could be moving purchasing a home. I mean, there's a large purchase here to start a business. They're solidifying a relationship. Yeah. Aquarius, if this resonated with you, if you want to pull your own energy in regards to this reading, please email me uh, to uh, schedule a reading or go over to the website and um, book your own reading there. Um, what else? Follow me on Instagram. My handles are below. Choose the funded page by clicking the GoFundMe link. Make sure that you're commenting below because it automatically enters you to win a free reading. Uh, Aquarius, know that I am praying for you. Pray for me as well. Take care, guys.